Yeah. Uh, you, who plays Wario in this? Uh, uh, Regnilla is pulling out the Wario a little bit. Oh, yeah. I've, been, I've been trying to work on a Wario myself, too, but it's not very good. No, stay Bowser. Yeah. yeah. Always, always <laughs> Bowser. Bowser. I, I, yeah, I can't do anything that's not Bowser. And even then, I can't do Bowser very well. But we got a, what, Losers Finals or Losers Semis? Losers Semis. semis. Yep. We Smash got the Southfield Nom. Special. Yep. Actually, Smasher was the one that put Nom in Losers to get oh. here. Yep. Can you hear that on the mic? Because I'm like, it's like rubbing um, no, the I glasses can't. against the, okay. Because I can hear, uh, what's happening is I'm, I'm moving, the glasses are moving up and down. And I hear it in the uh, in this. Oh, yeah. I don't yeah. know if it's picking up, though. No, nah, it's uh, just, you just hear it in your ears. I can rub my it. eye all the time. It sucks. Especially at night. Actually, every time I wake up in the morning, I feel like P. Diddy, and I have to rub my eyes. Yeah. I'm sure P. Diddy does that. Yeah, I think Nam, okay, Nam took a while to lock into Sheik there. Probably thinking about... Corrin. Yeah, Corrin. Definitely. I mean, I wouldn't disagree with it. Like, Mario, Corrin, uh, a volatile matchup for sure, but Corrin definitely has strong suits against Mario. Yeah. Mm, I don't know if... And, and I feel like think. Mario, Sheik, like... like Back when Sheik's like dominance was like really in play, Mario was one of the answers that people tried having. Yeah, definitely. especially like Ally. Ally like made that matchup like yeah, uh, Ally a, a revolutionized the matchup. Yeah. I feel like yeah. him and Anti, I would say. Yep. Um, so right now going into game one on FD, um, Sheik needle play is going to be really potent here just because of the stage. You have nowhere to really go. Yeah, but, but it's, it's so easy for Mario to get in, even on Sheik. Exactly. I was I literally took the razor right out of my mouth. Like, uh, the needles, like, they're not that big of a deal in this matchup because Mario's right in your face where you can't really use them safely. Back at, wow, I can't believe that bouncing fish is not Usually at lower percents, it uh, almost guaranteed, or it's, like, really hard to get out in a special friend in the way. he I think he DI'd away on the throw. Yeah, DI but, is so important with Sheik's throws. Yeah, absolutely. Couple forward airs. Stirring out the fireball with the air and continuing to go forward, hitting Smasher. Uh, yeah, I think maybe that Nair uh, might be something that Nam's going to opt for more because it beats the fireball and it starts a combo if he manages to hit him. Now, uh, Smasher, of course, also has the Mega Man. So if this doesn't work out, do you think we're going to opt to see the Mega Man here? No, I think he's going to stick with Mario. Mega Man Sheik, notoriously difficult for Mega Man. Not undoable, of course, but definitely difficult. Whereas uh, he already knows that he can take the set off Nam with Mario, as he did earlier in Winners. Oh, there. But Nam has made the proper adjustments so far this game, but that risky, risky side B. Yeah, he, I, he, that was meant to be a B reverse, 100%. Yeah. Anytime you're, anytime you're grenade. If he was me, he would never grenade, because my B reverses are the most crisp things you've ever seen. Mm, yeah. And also crisp is that back air, almost yeah. taking it. But Sheik definitely having that kill problem coming through. Yeah. And with the rage that Mario has here, an up smash will take it, even at 90%. Yeah, more than likely it'd be, uh, you know, Sheik's weight and all that. Um, maybe even a back throw at the ledge. Eh, maybe. Oh, <laughs> the close hitbox on the fort are spiking him down. Who does that? Who goes off stage versus Sheik? I guess Smasher does. Smasher does. When he really needs to get that stock. Oh, going for it again. Yeah. He would have gotten the sour spot there, but uh, that was Fortner. Yeah, Fortner. Taking it for Sheik. But, uh... Smasher is going to try to get right back into this. Get back in on Sheik. Get these combos going. Yeah, but, but honestly, both these characters really feed off of um, combos. Yeah. Sheik starts them from, uh, like, tilts and uh, mo mostly just tilts, honestly. And yeah, she's some, got, like, some, like, weak aerials. Yeah, and some, gra like, a little bit of grab stuff, but not yeah. nearly as potent as Mario's. Exactly, yeah, Mario's grab uh, grabs are extremely potent. And that's what Nam has to really look out for. That's why you see him spacing those four airs on shield like that, so he doesn't get shield grabbed. Yeah. There's the tilt, but backing up right when right once he sees um, Smasher trying to close himself in. Yeah, this is always going back. This is such an explosive matchup because both these characters are in each other's face the whole time, and they're just playing carefully around their shields. Yeah, it's kind of like Mario Fox in that sense too, where they're like so close to each other, like whenever they can be. Fireball helping us landing out there a little bit. Yeah, now I'm getting a lot of stray hits here, and it's really adding up. But it, it does add up, but not as much as Mario's hits do as we see the Forder putting him, uh, putting Sheik right down, back down on the ground. Yeah, and now, now I'm at kill percent, that up not going to take it. He Good tried to get the DI mixed up, but he, didn't, he couldn't quite get, uh, follow through with it. Oh, yeah, going for that. Now the, the smashes are coming out from Smasher. <laughs> Trying to get the kill. Ford smash kill cross stage, man. Yeah. That thing's powerful. Yeah, definitely if he gets the... <gasps> no, that, that, that hit? 
that was. I want to see a replay of that because I feel like he somehow extended his hitbox. That hit? I can't. That was weird. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he went for a back air or something. But yeah, just like kind of. All right, here it is. All right, watch, watch, watch this up air. The last hit of up air connecting somehow. Yeah, this is the forward air. Yeah. What happens? Okay, I think he gets hit by like a. Right here. Yeah. Oh, he did back. I'm pretty sure he back. But there's, I feel like there's no other explanation. Yeah, like, just he threw out some kind of hitbox and he extended it right out there for the the legs to kill. Very close game there. Just in really the final strange. moment, something, something strange like that can happen. Yeah. Yo, Juggle Boy gave us five bits, but look at how they are. They're like all split up. Oh, yeah. The, That's funny. The one, 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 one. Juggle Boy. Shout yeah. out to Juggle Boy. Yep. He always hugs me when he sees me at, like, um, events. Oh, I, I'm guessing oh, maybe you got them from the ads. He's talking about getting bits from ads. Yeah, you, yeah. yeah, you can. You get five bits per ad or something. So he just You can get between five to, like, a hundred. Wow. Oh, man. I need fun, to start doing that. Fun I fact, Juggle Boy. Uh... Is actually the juggler from Pokemon. They modeled it after him. Isn't that crazy? Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. I, I believe that. I would too. Oh, we're going for the Mega Man after all. Uh, kind of a risk here. I, I feel like the Sheik Mario match was so even in that first game. It just was a matter of like outplaying him in the end. Mm -hmm. But probably a comfort pick here. Sheik is definitely very good at shutting down Mega Man, getting it on him. But Mega Man definitely can uh, do things to Sheik. What the? Another extension hitbox there, but yeah, it's like, it's um, when it, you're in neutral, I feel like Mega Man has the advantage just because you know you're constantly pelleting them, you're you're getting Metal Blade control, getting all that kind of stuff. But when Sheik uh, gets a grabber is in Mega Man's face, it's a heavy disadvantage for yeah. Mega Man. Yeah, Mega Man does not have very like good get off me options. Right. Yeah. No, absolutely not. Like he's got good keep away, great yep. keep away, one of the best keep away games in the game. Absolutely. If we've seen anything from Kumari Kiri. All right. All right. Oh, I'm sorry. Come at me. Uh, uh, come at me. Yeah, my bad. Oh, that 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 platform play is very risky. Whoa. He's look. What he's looking for there is either an air dodge or a, a jump, because you can stuff out bouncing fish with either of those. Yeah. So Smasher being really smart, knowing the matchup, and like not not falling for either of those options. Ooh, that dash attack very risky. That Nam doing a great job, just doing chic things really. Not letting Smasher get too much damage in. I mean, he is at like a kind of high percent, but he's got to take this stock before. <gasps> oh wow! Beating out the Donna, that's kind of crazy. Cause that's like a, that's not even like Mega Man. Oh! I almost feel like he wanted wow. some kind of footstool shenanigans there. Nom really needs to take this stock before it gets out of hand, and the back here is gonna do it. Is. Yeah, the trade. Wow. I was about uh, to say Smasher can utilize this rage <laughs> to get an early kill. Bye. But, yeah, bye. Bye. Now he yeah. has the Metal Blade, which is smart. Yeah, rage off the table here. Actually, you know what? Uh, I feel like he doesn't want the Metal Blade because Sheik's A moves are so good. Like, just relying on B moves isn't really going to help Sheik out in this matchup. It can kind of in the neutral. We saw him charge needles when he had it in his hand, so you can at least do that and make it so he can't get the blade for free. Yeah, but... but he, absolutely, he needs the access to the tilts. Yeah, so he can't hold on to that blade forever. If he does, it's going to be a losing game in the long run. But not too much of an issue here, but what is an issue is Nam taking all this damage. 79%, only finally getting a little bit of a forward air string. There's the bouncing fish. I mean, yeah. Sheik, yeah, Sheik's way of getting back in these kind of games is like to just chip away. Yeah, that's pretty much all she can do. I mean, that's all really Mega Man can do, but... Um, Mega Man's Nom got a little bit like a, more kill power behind him. Yeah, Bob's in um, uh, the footstool percent, of course. It was a long time ago. You can do like the, the metal blade, uh, jab three times, and then uh, the up tilt. Yeah, the down smash. At, at this point, Smasher's main kill options are going to be that back throw or the back air. Yeah, I don't think back hit throw would kill yet, unless it was on the platform there. But yeah, or at the ledge. But the back air definitely is going to be some risky percentages coming up. Yeah, and I mean Smasher's starting to approach those risky percentages with like bouncing fish off the side of the stage here. Yeah. So we'll see if Nam can get any sort of setup that'll lead into that. Yeah, as long as he can avoid that, then uh, it might just be a matter of time. What? The swoosh, the wow. down tilt. Oh, and the swag metal blade. Going for the up wow. air. <gasps> All these falling up airs. Yeah, Smasher, yeah. like, trying to mix up his options between, like, grab and uh, what aerials he's approaching on with. Yeah. His mix your mix up game with Mega Man has to be really, really good. Ooh. Okay. Oh, wow. Yep, the, the back air. Quick back air. Yeah, nice big hitbox. I, I think Nom extended his own hurtbox, like we saw at the end of the first game. Yeah, we've been seeing that quite a bit. 
Looks really weird when it happens. <laughs> yeah, because it looks like he's hitting nothing for a second, but yeah. So proving me wrong, uh, the Mega Man pick working out, I feel like both of those matchups were very even. It just was a matter of who clutched out the kill in the end. Right, yeah, it's 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 gonna be who who takes the stock, but I think Smasher's gonna keep with the Mega Man. Yeah, uh, definitely more comfortable with it. Yeah. Maybe it'll depend on stage a little bit. We'll, we'll just have to see. Yeah, I'm not sure if the character pick or the stage pick happens first. I think the stage pick happens first. It's and then. Uh, stages and characters. Yeah. I only remember because uh, you see the character screen first, but that's second. I, uh, you have to like, reverse it. Oh, okay. I don't know. That's how I think of it. Right. It's the same thing with uh, a couple other things I think about, which is weird. I'm like, okay. Yeah, he is going for the Mario. Maybe, again, the stage pick. Yeah. Uh, we saw Town and City, and Mega Man does do pretty good on that stage. And now we're see yeah, this makes sense. So he's going to Dreamland to try the, uh, I bet, Nomban Battlefield. Yeah. And then now he's going to Dreamland. Um, or Smasher Band Battlefield. Because uh, this was Nom's counter pick. Oh, my bad. Okay, so Nom picked Dreamland. And then um, Smasher was like, let me switch to Mario. Yep. So yeah, that's definitely the strength of the counter pick advantage here in this matchup. Yeah, absolutely. Because the tri-platforms, as we've seen time and time again, carry uh, carry the combos with the up airs on uh, Mario. Ooh. Ooh. Nice uh, up tilt string, getting a bit of good damage, but not not enough to, not the full combo that could have been. Oh, But that dang. was a full read. Not the strong hit of the F smash, unfortunately, for Smasher. Yeah, it got the weak, like, weird palm hit almost. It's not like a smack. It was weird. Yeah, uh, the, the forward smack. <laughs> Smacker 1001. <laughs> Whoa, Ooh. another forward smash. I mean, you might as well go for him. Uh, if, you can probably, if you can maybe do it safely, uh-oh. Yeah, that's the thing with the Sheik matchup is, like, a lot of times, no matter what you do, you're getting the same punish. You're getting the same, like, combo starter, whether you misspace a jab or you misspace a forward smash. Yeah, there's not, there's, she doesn't have too many hard punishes. Yup, yup. A lot of people tech away in those situations. You just got to chase them down. Yeah, really smart read from Smasher. Even getting the reverse on the up smash to really make it connect. And that forward smash actually connecting and killing for Sheik. Yeah, we said we, uh, Sheik didn't have a hard punish, but... Yeah, I mean... Uh, the forward smash, but he spaced it really well to he where you, he wouldn't fall out of it. Because uh, Sheik, Sheik, a lot of the time, people fall out of it from the, uh, the, the second because the first hit. Uh, and then she moves forward and then... I don't know, it's just, it's just Sakurai, please, why? Yeah. Ooh. Wow, the power shields. Poo, yeah. Poo. I, I love that when they they trade power shields. I love when it's like three or more. It's like out of control. Two, it's like this weird timing thing, but three, it's like, okay, guys, come down. <laughs> two, two is definitely cool, though. Oh. Down air, not shielding the last hit. And notice Smasher almost always crosses his opponent up when he down airs, so. Yeah. you aspiring Mario mains out there. Cross up your opponent, it mixes them up. You can't get shield grabbed when that happens. Yep, especially with a character like Sheik. Uh, getting grabbed at this percent is not no bueno. No, definitely. Yeah. Uh, ooh. There's another cross up, and that time it leads to a grab, actually. It's really nice. Yeah, the down air, like when you don't get the last hit, it leads into so much, especially grabs. It does. And there's a cross up, but now I'm punishing it, so now I'm trying to pick up on it. Yeah, as we've seen the last two games, this is like dead even. Like last, no, last hit here. I mean, I feel like Mario's hits are going to secure the stock better, but you can never count on them. Right, yeah. Mario's definitely in kill percent for a lot of stuff, though. Yeah. I don't think he expected that near to hit, and the down smash might have connected. Yeah, exactly. Dash attack. Now he's in a bad position up there. No, just going to go for four there. No, Mario's no jump. Yeah, no jump. Oh, the up B? The early up B. Really yeah. smart. Yeah, almost killing even, but... Oh, so deep right now. Okay. I think Nam wanted the Vanish hitbox, because that can kill, of course. Now I'm going so aggressive on these platforms. Good pay. Oh, oh no. wow. Falling back here. Oh, oh and Smash is like, Ooh. Yeah, that was that was so tense. Such a tense scenario. Yeah. It's such a clutch back here. I, I, th I thought I was camping. It was so intense. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it was like, it's intense camping.